all right folks so what is going on today we're going to be going in with some maya kashis and we made a few uh why did i do that i did it again i did it again because i got distracted by that little thing right there i clicked first when this is a going second deck all right so yeah man um yeah so the uh what's the name when i uh, the new stuff did get revealed while i was playing but they weren't um let, how would i not even how would i say this but they weren't let me see if i can there we go all right yeah there weren't um i guess we're not gonna get a door right now um i'll be right back all right folks so we are back apparently that guy didn't want to play him man. i guess he felt that the the mayakashi would be too much for him but yeah um i like to go second with this deck because the fact that it restricts you from your extra deck um when you use the effect that's pretty bad and also with this okay um yeah, and also with this is pretty much a one card you can at least put 30 at least 4300 on board uh instantly with this card um we did draw this so what we can do is we can go solitaire unizombie we could send gozuki to special summon this use his effect and then we can just start we can start doing magical things there that is something we can do but we'll also still have a tuner with uh what's name and then we can make it a five matter of fact we don't think we even need to make it a five do we we can all right so we can also start off with samurai skull but that doesn't get us nowhere let's start off with this um solitaire and let's see what we can get popping let's see what we can get popping threatening war that's fine all right that's threatening war so <clears throat> i mean threatening roar so pretty much he's going to be stalling for now so since he's stalling i feel like we should do a different move should we should go gozuki special summon banshee um go sucker that doesn't get us nowhere um huh i guess we could just start off with this um yeah i guess we could start off with this since we do have the threading war so i definitely by next turn we should be able to win here just activate the zombie world wait doesn't it add to your hand too oh you just activate it from your hand or what's the name um true shell yes um man this card is, is just so amazing it's just really a great card but yeah we definitely set up for next turn um without the threatening war we it, it, we could have easily put a lot of damage on board just now easily um he's probably going to kill this which is fine because in the end phase i can just banish what is it face up monster no i could just banish the phase down and then you guys already know where this is going um this is not you know this, this is not the hardest thing to do um, but apparently our opponent wants to do fancy things. Um, so what we'll do is we'll banish his face down monster, Stealth Bird. All right, so this is a a burn deck, apparently. Turn that to attack. And then what we can do is activate Samurai Skull, which in then would get us another uh, Drew Shell activation. <clears throat> So we can just banish the Soul of Flare Dragon. Um, guess we get to send Mizuki. Um, and then yeah, let's do this stuff. Let's let's do some fun stuff here. Um, I I think I do run Shogun Saga. I think I do. But the sad thing about um, the two star tuner. No, you don't have that. Wait, we can negate it. Yeah, cause it's in the graveyard, and that yeah, we can negate that, right? Yeah, we can negate that effect. Yeah, because they're, they're... Oh, okay, so... Is that how it works? I don't think that's correct. <laughs> because, I mean, no, I think it negates this, but I, I'm pretty sure it wouldn't negate, like, hand traps or anything, even though there's zombies in the... I'm not sure how that works. That doesn't sound too right. Um, all right, do we have anything that pops the back row? No, we, I mean, we do have... Uh, what, where is it at? Which one that pops the back row here? It's the seven one, right? Yeah, so what we can do here is just send the two star, I believe. You can also just send Gozuki and do the exact same thing here. Um, Cause if we send Mizuki, we can just go into the seven and then, um, yeah, it would, it would just do it like this. We'll just do it like this. We're going to the seven. 
and then the seven will trigger i mean the two star will trigger um but yeah man uh once you use this you get you can't special summon during the turn so that is pretty bad um actually should we, yeah we should just go nine um and that that sucks that does suck um but i understand why <laughs> i definitely understand why they did that um because definitely you would um you man we we trust me zombies can easily put a shit ton of damage on board um with you know with the relative ease like we we can really push we can really put it on our opponent so that's not really the problem we'll just pop that that doesn't target um all right so that should be game here but yeah they i mean we can't special summon and then use this effect because you know we're just too good for all that but yeah man we got the victory we're good we had the uh monster be more but yeah uh not really uh the greatest explanation but we will get more into it uh next game all right so let's see what we can do against tachulu um come on man come on come on i'm trying to go second don't make me go first we do have two back to the fronts in here just in case we do end up going first but look this is what i'm talking about going oh this is good this is good um i usually like to ask the terraform but he's playing a 45 card deck so i'm not sure if that's even like acceptable to ash right now i'm um, dragon vivine um do we even stop that do we you know what i don't i don't i don't i really want to he's sending the drag monster to his grave so let's see what he's doing here um if it's like the if it's the four star i'm not negating if it's any dragoonity monster i might negate depending on what dragoonity monster it is if it's the tuner it's pointless um if it's the shrudo it's kind of pointless to do it all this stuff is kind of pointless you, you guys can pretty much get the um hmm all right so he's playing pendulums that's definitely getting ashed um so yeah that was oh you have a call by the grave you are a fucking filthy bitch oh you have gamma you you're good man you're a good man all right so we're not we're not winning this game folks i'm just gonna let you know that right now oh actually no no because he's gonna still send the four star he's gonna just go omega banish card on my hand hopefully um he is back to no actually i hope he hits this the i hope i want to keep one of the and he hits one for one the best card in my hand okay well never mind you know you, you can always i, I mean no, i wasn't expecting gamma so i'm not going to sit there and say i should have just asked the um effect to add but because i did want to give him a pendulum monster so that means he has to have a pendulum monster in his hand which is this okay and then he could i don't know i don't think this hand is that good though because he has to have two pendulums in his hand um, and if he doesn't have two pendulums in his hand, he at least has to search the. Oh, okay, never mind. I don't even know why I said that. Um, this week, I, I forgot about this. I keep forgetting about this card. Um, and then this becomes a seven, and he can pendulum summon two. Uh, all right, so possibly should I have waited for the for that guy? I don't know. I, I'm not sure. I mean, I wasn't expecting Gamma. I think Ashen right there was the correct play um yeah i mean yeah i, I wasn't expecting gamma <laughs> that gamma fucking hurt so that's the i mean that, i think that was the correct move M more likely than not that is the most correct move because giving them a free pendulum just gives them access to electrolyte and you definitely want to stop as many pendulum monsters for free that they can special summon as possible so i don't think it really mattered um when i, I mean yeah like i said this is just happening um, there's nothing I can do really. Um, if I draw foolish, we're fine. Oh, that's good too. Um, let me see here. So what we can do is activate this. Pretty sure he should, he should not negate this. If he does negate it, it's pretty bad. All right. So we'll just add this guy. Um, I mean, there's just absolutely nothing we can do. He's just going to negate the effect and then put it back in the deck. And I think we just lose from here. Um, that that game of fucking hurt. That game of fucking hurt the soul. He had double. Oh wait, no, no, no. This is this is this not no 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 coming back. Jesus man, that gamma is something crazy. That gamma was something crazy. Um, all right, so we're just drawing some weird hands all of a sudden. But apparently that's just what happened. We're just weird hands all day. 
um, but we can dip we can definitely do a lot with this um, depending on what we draw um, actually no no we, we can we can definitely we can definitely win no wait we can't because we can't oh, okay we're playing my Akashi's pretty sure he's playing my Akashi's um, hopefully he's not playing extra link because he's made extra link we're in trouble all right so it's like one card off from the extra link if he sends the spirit master it's 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 going down um, if he sends a Mizuki, I think we're fine. Oh no, it's a Mayakashi. Okay, that's fine. Um, Mizuki? Oh, you have Soul Charge, huh? Oh, fully good. I mean, the same exact thing. The same exact thing. Um, we're not able to do too much with this hand, actually. Um, because. What? Oh, okay, it's Soul Charge. Alright, so. I mean. <laughs> I guess, I guess, you know, I just fucking guess. It's so amazing that you just have so charged and you summoned four for what reason? Come on, Bruce. What was that? What was that, Bruce? There was no reason to summon four. Absolutely no reason to summon four. You just lose this effect for no reason. Ah, man, it sucks. Um, But yeah, the play I was thinking about was going sucker and then going sorceress. And then special summoning this, but like I said, you, you're pretty much locked out of your extra deck if you if you use this effect. I mean, I mean basically if you you if you're planning on using this effect, um, you're locked out of your extra deck. Besides my Akashi's, and that's like I said, that's the main problem with me. That's why I don't really like the deck. It's way too restrictive, entirely too restrictive. Like this should have just said rest of the turn. That would have easily like all these other ones only say it when it's on the field, but this one and this one I believe. No, yeah, this one is just you. Yeah, like, see, like right now, he's okay. Well, he can go into the nine now, but I'm just saying like he was almost just stuck right there, and he can't like he can't synchro to like all these effects are just really <laughs> these effects are just really really and I mean really restrictive. And it's uh, so bad. All right, I don't even think Regeki even helps in this situation. The one time Regeki doesn't help. Wow. Uh, but he only has 4,000 left, so we can definitely game shot him. I play Shogun Saga, don't I? Yeah, we can definitely game shot him. If I feel like it, I can definitely game shot him. 100% game shot him. As long as he doesn't have a back row that I know he's going to set. Okay, so we can definitely game shot him. Ooh, we can super league game. We can really fucking game shot him. But the fact that this stops your effects is kind of worrisome. Can one for one bring out the one to go to the three? I mean, go to a synchro and go to the three star. Um, hmm. I'm trying to see. It. I can't attack this, so I have to get rid. Actually, I could just regeki here, huh? But then the three. He doesn't have the three star in his grave, does he? No, um, so basically only he would trigger and he would trigger, but then he would be unaffected by card effects for the rest of the turn. Um, okay, so let's just start off with the Regeki. They should all trigger, right? Yeah, they should be able to trigger. Um, oh wow, they all trigger. Okay. All right. Well, I mean, they all trigger, but he has to banish what? He has to banish one... He has to banish uh, one, two. He has to banish three zombies, and he has one, two, three, four. So I guess he's going to banish Solitaire, Yaksha, Yasha, and Unizombie. I would think those are the three you banish. Um, what? Oh, I think they. Oh, they have to be in graveyard. Never mind. Well, folks. Never mind. They forget what I was talking about here. Yeah, so yeah, this this game is over. Um, let's get the two star tuner. Um, and yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do this the correct way. No, that was a bad. <laughs> I was about to lose immediately. Um, but yeah, uh, like I said, man, the restrictions really hurt. They really fucking hurt. I mean, I mean, they really hurt. But like I said, I think the deck is better going second. Um, because you're able to at least, you know, do some fantastic stuff here, I guess. Um, I mean, like I said, the deck is just a lot better going second, but it, it really fucking hurts because um, the fact that um, 
Oh, this game is like 1,000% over. The the fact is that uh, <clears throat> um, what what I'm about to say? The fact that you can't go into your extra deck besides Makashi just really really hurts. Um, but yeah, I think I think we got game here. But I'm I'm about to make a mistake right now. I'm about to make this crucial mistake, folks. And I mean, this is crucial. Watch this. Watch how I do this. Watch how I do this. This is going to be one of the worst mistakes. If if he realizes what he can do, he if he realizes what's going to happen here, um, if he act, oh wait, oh I shouldn't have did that. He shouldn't. If he special summons this card in attack mode, he loses. But um, yeah, we I think we I think we win here. If he special summons this in attack mode, we we just win. If he special summons this in attack mode, we mill three, right? No, destroy his spell and trap. He should summon it in defense mode. He should, but then if he does, I can just attack over this. So I think he is going. No, it doesn't matter. He's, he's, he's he lost anyways. Either, either way he does it, he's just gonna lose. He, either way he does it, I don't know why you. Yeah, see, either way he does it, you're just gonna lose here. Then we just get normal summon this. Um, but yeah, this is why you should definitely go second with this deck. 100%. It should be a going second deck. Um, I'm not even gonna. What's the name? What is the one that mills three? This one. Uh, we'll, we'll just get tangled here so this is why i did this play it's because um usually i mean if he doesn't uh what's the name yeah see we can just do that so um we actually have to banish the one star here see that's what you can do with that and then now uh, that's unaffected but yeah like i said this is the going second deck as you can see this is all just from a one for one and a mizuki so yeah that's um that's cool if he drops a gore, I'm gonna be very upset. Okay, <laughs> I was about to say if he drops a gore, I'm gonna be very upset. All right, folks. So yeah, this is the uh, Mayakashi deck that I built. Um, like I said, I'm just testing stuff out. Most likely, Brigeki might leave. But yeah, like I said, with the deck is um, it's it's it, it's it's a strange deck. I, f I feel like going second is the best way to play it because, like I said, you you can just put massive damage on board if we. I mean, they probably need a theme one for one or something that special summons Makashi. From, I mean, this is already good enough. You know what? Never mind. I, I mean, I don't know. This deck just did not need to be like if they were not just like if there are basically effects is just whenever they're summoned or during the turn they're summoned, then it would have been a lot better. But the fact that you have to special summon it from the graveyard, you can only control one. And then this also restricts you from the extra deck. It's very, it's very uh, a niche arch type, but it is fun. I can tell you that it is fun. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy it. Um, uh, hopefully you guys, uh, uh, like I said, oh, I don't know why I'm about to repeat myself, but yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy that. Let me know what you think about the deck. Also, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. And if you want to help the channel, links are in the description down below, or you guys can click and add. Either or is fine with me. Thank you very much. I will be back in a couple hours, so stay tuned.